everyone, it's Patricia. Today I want to show you guys two projects I created for Carla Zizzer, one as a guest designer. So let me start showing you guys what I created. The first project that I created is a chocolate mini album that I created from scratch using a medium weight chipboard. And uh, the mini album measures three inches by seven inches approximately. So um, I used two paper lines for this mini album. The first paper pad that I used is uh, by Mama's Eye and it's the Be Happy... Um, paper line and it's super cute guys I love this paper so much a lot of beautiful papers in here and then for the chocolate part of the mini album I used the, also the paper by my mind's eye but it's the breeze collection from uh, last year that they came out with and it's super cute I love this paper as well so I used uh, those two paper lines to create this mini album and um, for the front cover of uh, the page I uh, used some eyelids and then some Webster Pages trim that Carla carries in her Etsy store and then to make the banner I used burlap trim that Carla carries also and some of the leaf trim as well and then I just um, by hand uh, freely cut some triangles and then I used some uh, alphas from the girls paper read to spell out laugh there and over here is the beautiful um, Juliana's um, porcelain flower from Carla's Etsy store as well and then some more burlap trim here and then this is a medium bird that uh, Carla also carries in her Etsy and then I just added some more flowers and um, butterflies from um, the Martha Stewart punch and then here's a flower also from Carla's Etsy store and I'm not sure what the um, item number is specifically on Carla's Etsy store but uh, the item number on this bag says it's A131-Pink and these are super cute guys they add so much detail to your projects and what I did, I basically took the center apart and I just used the bottom for the front page cover. And then I just added some crochet um, flower on top and then the pearl to the center. And that's basically it for the front page. It's really simple and cute. And then on the following page, I um, used some of the Cynthia Luhu's mesh bling here in the pink tone. And the, I just made a little tag here and it's double sided. And here is the... Um, the outline of the butterfly punch that uh, I punched out to go in the mini album so I just used the backing of it and I just used it here and here's a rosette trim from Carl's Etsy store that I just freehand cut into a heart some more of those leaves from Carl's Etsy store and here's a flower from Iron Roses and then over here is uh, the petals from Iron Roses and some more burlap trim from Carl's Etsy store and then over here I used another outline from the butterfly punch that I punched out so I just still use the outside I think it goes so well here on this page as well and that's basically it for this page too and then on this page I used uh, this beautiful trim from Carl's Etsy store it's organza with pink satin on the center and then here I just made a beautiful pinwheel out of um, the double side paper from Mama's Eye. And then over here to the pinwheel that I made, I added a wood skewer. And then just a pearl to the center just to make more realistic look. And then this is a mat that does not remove. I will still add more mats here eventually. And then here is a die cut from uh, the Miss Caroline stickers. And it's this one right here. And I just use this sticker down here. And then I also used a um, Juliana's uh, shabby uh, porcelain and ribbon flower here. And then over here I added more butterfly from Martha Stewart, the 4mm flyback pearls in the white tone. A crochet flower that I have in my stash, another pearl to the center. And then over here I made a pocket on this one and uh, this is a tag that just goes in here so I can add a picture and some journaling in this one. And that's it for this page as well. And then on the following page I kept it very simple. I just put a sticker from the same uh, Miss Caroline label stickers and uh, over here I used this uh, porcelain flower from Carl's Etsy store and these flowers are attached together they're super cute let me just show you guys a closer look to them these are adorable to use in so many projects guys they're so tiny and they could fit in any project aren't these precious if my camera will focus these are adorable and as you can see the back they are flat so uh, they will uh, just be placed anywhere and they could work it into any project. These are super cute. I love working with those. And um, and that's basically it for this page. I just cut out some little strips and I put them here. It's very simple. I just say such a happy day on this page. And then on the following page, I used the uh, rosette trim from Making Memories. And then I used some uh, pleated trim in the cream tone or beige. And then I just made a little banner here and it says be yourself. Some Iron Roses flowers down here. And this is another Juliana porcelain flower to the center. More crochet flowers here and another pearl to the center. 
and the, this mat right here does not remove but uh, I did make it in a way that I could still pop a picture underneath there and I made another pocket here and here's a paper that I could put a picture and some journaling inside and that's it for this page too and then on the following page is a very simple too so I just made a little um, freehand cup banner here it just falls off from another wood skewer and over here some more iron roses flowers some more of that leaf trim from Carl's Etsy store and here's a beautiful flower from Carl's Etsy store as well these are beautiful guys they come so many in the pack I believe 144 for five dollars that's an awesome price and over here is another uh, die cut from the butterfly punch that I cut out and I just recycled again the paper instead of uh, throwing it out I just uh, placed it there and it's still cute guys and here's another tiny flower for my roses and then to this corner I just uh, cut out uh, the four millimeter flyback pearls in the white tone and I just added the corner here and that's basically it for this page I could still add a picture underneath here tuck it in the mat and uh, on the following page I added some of this beautiful pink uh, trim from Carlos Etsy store and more um, petals for my roses some die cuts from my mind's eye and then here's uh, where I could put a a picture and some journaling here and then here's another pocket that I created and some more places where I could put a picture and uh, some journaling side here as well and this page is very simple too I had a lot of fun creating this mini album guys and then on the following page and over here is some more die cuts that I freehand cut by hand and over here just fell wonderful day and these alphas are from the girls paper re and here's another backing of that flower that I showed you guys before from Carlos Etsy store I have some crochet trim to the center and then another flower back pearl some more of the leaf trim from Carlos Etsy store in the cream tone another flower from Carlos Etsy store as well and then over here I added some of that Cynthia Lou who's mesh bling and I just added some pearls to the center just to give me that uh, two color look and that's basically it for this page as well. I had a lot of fun creating that too. And then on the following page, I kept it very simple. I just had some of that making memory trim, some more iron roses flowers, and some pearls, um, more of that um, leaf trim that Carla carries in her Etsy store in a variety of colors. And uh, over here, I added another banner that I freehand cut it by hand. And then I just added another sticker from the Miss Caroline label stickers. And it just says, too cute for words. And over here is another butterfly from the Martha Stewart punch. More flyback pearls from the 4mm in the white tone. And over here I made another pocket with a tag that I'll add some journaling and uh, another picture. And that's basically it for this page as well. And then on um, the back of the mini album I still need to just write my signature. And that'll basically be it for the mini album and add pictures and tons of journaling. And that's one of my projects for Carl 001. And for my second project, I created a tree bag using this burlap bag that uh, Carla carries in her Etsy store. This bag measures uh, 5 by 7 so it's a nice size uh, burlap bag. All I did to it is just cut out the strings that uh, come attached to this bag and I added some of the Webster Pages trim inside of it and then I just made a bow. And uh, over here I added a heart that I freehand cut from the beautiful rosette trim that Carla carries in her Etsy store. I added a eyelet and I attached this to some burlap rope. And here's a die cut that I just freehand cut and I punched out the corners with um, the Martha Stewart punch. Here's a doily from my stash back here. And uh, over here to the burlap bag, I used the same flower that I used in the front cover, but I just didn't remove the center. I left the center on this one. And all I did to bring out the color of the natural flower, I used some glossy accents to the whole flower. And it just made really sturdy the flower. And it's really beautiful, guys. I love using that technique with the glossy accents and the flowers. Very beautiful. So I added that here. And another flower from Carl's Etsy store. And this is the beautiful spray that Carla carries, the wheat spray. And the color carries these in variety of colors in her Etsy store as well. And here's uh, another medium uh, bird that Carla carries in her Etsy store. And she carries the small ones as well. And um, for the bag, to close off the bag, I use this uh, beautiful um, leaf trim that Carla carries in variety of colors. And inside, guys, there's a, a marshmallow bunny lollipop. Super cute. I think it went so well inside this burlap bag. And that's basically it guys for my two projects for Carla's Zerzer 1 as a guest designer. I had so much fun creating these two projects. And please don't forget to stop on by Carla's Etsy store and show her some love. And as always guys, happy scrapping. Bye guys.